been pretty amazing. Uh, been here with the NBA and WNBA Cares program, partnered with uh, Sports United and the U.S. Embassy, and just trying to bring um, a sense of basketball with uh, the Olympics coming up here to the community and to the kids here in London. And we visit some awesome schools and really try to ingrain in the kids that having that balance, getting involved in sports, and also um, your education is very important. We want to bring some attention, some enlightenment to some of the young, young people here, um, not just only here, but wherever we go, from China to, uh, to Africa, to some of the places I've been. And uh, we try to exploit uh, what basketball is and try to give them some fundamental skills. Uh, we can't teach them a whole game or anything like that, but we try to employ what's, what it takes to be an athlete. My mom used to always tell me, get up and do something that you love. And I love the game of basketball, so it's easy for me to get up and prepare for competition or for battle, as we like to call it. <laughs> it's one of those sports that can really bring you together, and it's about a team. And it's like any other sport that has team sports, but it's one of those things that once you start playing, you get that kind of high off of playing and competing with one another. Uh, the Olympics is a big thing and uh, it's not a something that you know you're just playing a game for yourself, you're playing for your country. When I played um, we, we, we represented well and was fortunate to win the gold medal. 2004 was pretty amazing because I was so young back then and kind of had this naive sense that oh you'll get about five more medals. <laughs> Uh, but to really stand up on that podium and hear the Star Spangled Banner, um, I said I wasn't going to cry. And obviously I cried and I'm getting all these text messages like, you're crying on TV. <laughs> uh, but it's an awesome feeling to come from humble beginnings, knowing that you're this kid that a lot of people didn't think was the most talented. But now you're representing your country is awesome. And to have an opportunity to come back in 2012 and really finish off my Olympic uh, career would be amazing to get on that podium again and raise uh, the banner and win gold.